Well, nights like these are just what you hope for as a spectator. A warm welcome. My name is Derek Ray, and joining me in the commentary position is the former Arsenal and England fullback Lee Dixon. And what we have coming up for you is live action from Liga. It's Mets against Paris Saint Germain. Yeah, thank you, Derek. I'm really looking forward to this. Both teams certainly capable of producing some entertaining football. Hopefully, we'll get that. His skill level simply off the charts. Neymar, the player we're referring to, Lee. Well, the more you give this lad the ball, the better the team normally plays. He switches the ball, he links play from left to right, up and down the pitch. He keeps possession, a brilliant player. The lineup then for the hosts. Looks as though they're going with the belt and braces approach. Yeah, 5 3 2 or 3 5 2. The midfield will be flooded when they've got the ball. Defensively, those fullbacks will be asked to supply support to their three centre backs, but it does enable you to play two strikers up front. And here is the initial Allez, 11 for Paris Saint Germain. Kaylor Navas gets the nod in goal. Marquinhos plays alongside Presnel Kimpembe at the back. Kylian Mbappe starts with Angel Di Maria on the flanks. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. Well, sometimes there's no great mystery in terms of a team's preferred style, and the visitors do like to press high. It's very much their game. Lee, would you expect to see more of that? Yeah, I think it's their preferred option for sure. It'll be interesting to see how high and how long they press for in this game. It's a really physical way of playing. That tactic suits them, but can they do it for all of the game? Can they create something from here? Alert defending. Seca. This looks promising. Have they given him too much space? It looks promising. Couldn't keep it. Paredes. Well, that's one for them to pursue. It could be for Mbappe. And a goal! Not wasting much time today. They strike first. Well, here's the replay. He's done really well to get his head up and pick out a teammate. And it's a sweet strike. Absolutely lovely, controlled, stylish finish. And underway again here with PSG in front. Thomas Delane. Well, they continue their push for the equaliser, but definitely not forcing it. Maiga. And a fine tackle. Verratti. Dangerous looking through ball. The defender doing his job.
They take it short. Really good challenge. Well, that's a good deflection. That'll be a corner. They favoured a short one here. And crossing towards the far post. Foiling them effectively. Bulaya. On the ball, Iseka. Mbappe. Mbappe. That's how to rob them of possession. Good ball to switch the play. Looks promising this. Bulaya. Wagner. Maiga. Real chance. It's still alive. Was an important piece of defending. Much more straightforward for the keeper this time, but previously he had work to do. Well, double bubble. He gets the ball in the end, but the first save he makes, absolutely brilliant. Well, PSG have hardly seen the ball, but to their credit, they've been absolutely blistering on the counter-attack. They just sit back, hit you on the break, and it's really working for this team. He's failed to hold it, Neymar. And the counter looks on here, options available. Defenders need to cover, and whipped into the box. A decisive clearance it was. Verratti. Keane. There will be one minute added on at the end. And so it is, the first half story has been written. Well, a typically influential performance from Angel Di Maria in that first half. Lee, how would you assess what he's put into the match? Well, Derek, you're right, he has played well and goal... And the referee sounding the second half into action. PSG with the lead. Diallo, Verassi now, here's Diallo, Mbappe, Verassi, Wagner, Farid Boulaya with it, and a strong tackle. Paredes and Keane Verratti and continues his run and back with Neymar can they convert and a goal they've increased the lead and they don't want to be throwing it away from here Well, here's the goal again, and it's a great ball to put him through. And sometimes, with all the time in the world, you can fluff your lines. But he composes himself and slips it past the keeper beautifully. Well, enjoy the good days as a coach. It could be a roller coaster ride, I can tell you that. Substitution it is for PSG. It's going their way, 2 0. Big tour of Paris Saint Germain. Le numéro 6, Marco Verratti. Maiga. Santons. Now they've lost it. 
Half an hour remaining then. Di Maria. Room to manoeuvre on the wing. Can he play it in? You can sense the threat is there. Di Maria. Verassi. Can he put it away? In it goes! A three-goal cushion! This is astonishing stuff! Well, here's the replay. It's a really lovely through ball. But then there's still plenty to do. You have to say it's a really nice finish just to guide it into the net. Lovely goal. PSG are going to switch things around on the personnel front. The ball rolling again in what has been an utterly one-sided match. Maiga. It comes to absolutely nothing. Dylan Braun. Good looking ball. There could be a chance now. And the alarm bells are ringing. What a vital intervention. Changement pour le Paris Saint-Germain. Joueur sortant. Le numéro 6, Marco Verratti. Remplacé par le numéro 12, Rafinha. Over it comes. Well, no end product. It's one corner after another. Changement pour le FCMS. Sort du terrain. Le numéro 24, Aaron Leia Iseka. À sa place, le numéro 11, Opa Nguyet. Played into the center of the box. Fifteen minutes remaining. Danilo Pereira. It's with Danilo Pereira. Oh, nice ball. Di Maria. Well, oh, they have the ball once more. Well, he's given a corner, they referee. Neymar is having a wonderful game and proving to be a real handful for the defenders, Lee. Yeah, he's linked everything together, hasn't he? The team is no team without the glue to knit it into a complete working machine. He's that glue in some and an assist to boot. He's driven in the corner. Not to be this time. Mbappe. And here's Florenzi. No foul. PSG advantage. The referee spotted the infringement and it will be a free kick in a position of genuine menace. Neymar has a go here, and a goal almost bewitching in its beauty, excellent technique.
Well, here's the replay, and it's lovely. You can't blame the keeper. He can't go early and gamble. It's lovely technique to bend the ball over the wall. It's perfect. Well, no wonder he's delighted. They've been bossing this game up to now. It's a massive lead, and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now. Maiga. Dylan Braun. Couldn't hang on to it. Rafinha. Mbappe. And the referee has deemed that an additional four minutes are in order. Kuyate. Nget. Now there to intercept. And there goes the final whistle. Not the result the fans were hoping for, Lee. Well, Derek, they were out for today, and that's unforgivable. You don't mind being outplayed, and they surely were, but not to put up a fight, that's a scandal. That's always an enjoyable experience watching Neymar. Lee Dixon, your verdict on his performance? Well, he played well, scored a goal. What a good performance from him.